Hey Tribe, it's not Crystal Thursday, but I wanted to talk about one crystal this month. That's the Crystal Emerald. Yeah, because you know, Emerald is May's birthstone. I have some tumbled emerald right there. So shout out to all the May people. I have some emerald gemstones. I'll show that to you. In the hot wait. Let me try. I have some beautiful raw tumbled emerald. And then some a few gemstones. Really pretty. Emerald is a form of barrel mineral. The most beautiful ones you can find are in Colombia. You can also find them in Brazil, Russia, Egypt, Africa, and Australia. Well, Egypt's in Africa, but yeah. So people all over the world have been using emerald for a very long time. But check it out. There's speculation that a lot of the green stones talked about in the past, i.e. the stone on the Ark of the Covenant, it said that it was emerald, but some people are saying that it was actually moldavite. So yeah, they're saying like a lot of the stones possibly that people labeled as emerald in the past, you know, it could possibly have been another green stone, but people only really knew about emerald back then. Fun fact, emerald is a stone that has been sought after quite a lot. So you have the Emerald Tablets of Thoth, which is an ancient alchemy book that contains some of Earth's oldest secrets for knowledge and power. This book was actually carved out of emerald. Then you have King Solomon. It was said that he was given four rings of power by God, and one of those rings was emerald. The world's largest emerald is actually located in the Smithsonian, and it is a whopping 858 carats. This thing is huge. Yeah, so some metaphysical properties for emerald are Emerald is a stone that represents free flowing energy and directly empowers our heart center. So this contains pure forms of love, compassion, sensuality, and healing. This crystal harnesses our true emotional body and is able to project that into the physical realm. So emerald can bring hope, abundance, help you with a heartbreak, you're going through a breakup, it can help. Go get you a nice, really pretty piece of emerald jewelry. It will definitely cheer you up. I promise you that. Emerald is known as the stone of successful love. Green, and that's, you know, associated with our heart chakra. Emerald is one of our four precious gemstones, along with sapphire, diamond, and ruby. So, and it's such a pretty, deep, dark green. It's not hard to show. Yeah, it's just such a beautiful, beautiful dark green. So pretty. Focus this thing. So physical healing properties, it rejuvenates. It combats aging, fertility, skin problems, emotional healing, hope, courage, abundance, romance, helping with the heartbreak, clairvoyance, and just like sensitivity. It's supposed to help with misfortune too. So actually, Emerald is considered one of the best manifestation crystals that will help you materialize your dreams and desires. So, you know, all green crystals are manifestation to the umph degree crystals like Malachite. Those are manifestation stones, green money, you know, anything green manifestation. So this is connected to the divine love to help you on your spiritual journey. This stone will encourage you to live life, providing compassion and unconditional love. Emerald improves all kinds of relationships. So it's good for marriages and helping you connect with your kids. And it helps repel nightmares, evil spirits, and it brings wisdom and fortune. Go get you some emerald. And you know, the tumbled stones are just as pretty, but you know, the gemstones are really, really pretty. Shout out to all the May birthdays. My mom, her birthday's this month, and my friend Misty, I know for sure her birthday's this month also. So yeah, happy birthday guys. And wear you your birthstone around your neck. Not the gemstone version, the tumbled version.
yeah and you could wire wrap it and have a wire wrapped emerald around your neck yeah. and the tumbled ones aren't as expensive as the gemstones so pretty cool too but i just think green and gold are so beautiful together yeah yeah i get you some but that's all i have for today guys love and light to you all